All right, so first, just tell us your name and something exciting going on in your life right now. My name is Toya. Right now, I am in a beauty pageant running for Miss Georgia Teen, and I will be attending SCAD very soon. How'd you get into doing pageants and stuff like that? Basically, I got a letter in the mail, and from then on, I just went for it. And I really like to showcase my beauty, my talent, and stuff like that, so why not? Yeah, there's a lot of different dimensions to beauty, I think. What is beauty to you? Beauty to me is not just the outside, but also the inside. Even though it's very nice to get done of, it makes you feel good. But you also have to feel good on the inside. I'm very happy with my life at the moment, actually. What kind of things do you do to cultivate your inner beauty? Basically, read a lot of like self-healing books and stuff like that. Try to tap in with my inner child, myself more. I've been getting to know myself for a little bit now. I've been single for a while. So, yeah. Yeah, I feel like self-healing is something we all got to tap into a little bit more during the pandemic. But exactly. what are some of your favorite ways to connect with yourself? Doing things that make my inner child happy, like I said. Spending time with family, spending time with myself. I love watching like old movies <laughs> that I used to watch with my family. It's just the love I surround myself with, really. Cool. So if you were to explain what your dream is for your life and like what that would look like, if it played out in the ideal way in the next five years, what would that look like? Basically, I would be a fashion stylist for celebrities, movies, all type of things, models, brands. I would have my own penthouse living in the city, a nice car, hopefully like a Jeep or something. But yeah, and then maybe kids more down the line, but a dog or something, yeah. Okay, bet. And uh, do you have an idea of what you would like your legacy to be? Like, like when Kobe passed, his legacy was like very clear the way he inspired people. So when you're not around, what do you want people to feel or think? I want people to always feel like she always expressed herself. She never was nobody else but her. She stood her ground. She helped uplift other people. I, I try to do my best to uplift people because I know how it is to be at the bottom sometimes. Yeah. That's beautiful. Thank you. And how would you define love? What does that mean to you? Love, you could get it externally, yes, but it really comes from internally. You'll never find love until you love yourself. So make sure you pour all that love into yourself and love will naturally come to you, naturally find you. Wise words. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you. No problem. Okay, let me get the outfit. I love the socks, the colors. <laughs> Beautiful. Thank you. Thank you so much for sharing. No problem. Thank you.